here. Takes no prisoners. I am what I am. I'm a Trump guy. That's right. I'm a Trump guy. I know she's a woman, I guess, but I'm a Trump guy. I, because in that macho thing that I mean, you know, take no prisoners thing. So we just say guy thing. From Northwest Georgia, one of the most conservative uh, district, congressional districts in the country, rated in the top 10. In addition to that, almost all white. Vino, you're not welcome up in Northwest Georgia, in Marjorie Taylor country. You're not welcome up there. Only about 7% of her district is African American, marginal Hispanic, even marginal less Asian American. Country boys up there. Good old boys up there. I mean, guitar playing, guitar strumming, Confederate flag waving, gun toting guys up in Northwest Georgia. Vino, are you planning a vacation up there anytime soon? You're not, you're not jetting to Northwest Georgia. How about Dalton, Georgia? <laughs> Don't get caught in, Dal in Dalton when the sun comes down, Vino. We may have to come there with a casket for you. I don't know. All right, Marjorie Taylor Greene. She, as we well know her story, by now, uh, she she won in a runoff, a landslide, by the way. A lot of folk down there, the good old boys and girls down in that neck of the woods, they love her to death. Can do no wrong. One of them, I mean, just a flag waving, that, by the way, not American, Confederate flag waving, good old country girl. I mean, doesn't get any better than old Marge. We just love Marge. Marge is our kind of good old girl. Good girl. Good old girl. Good old gal, you know, 10 gal in the hat, cowboy boots, all that good stuff, walking around there spewing all the QAnon stuff, all the racist stuff, all the anti-immigrant, all the anti-Muslim, all the anti-everything, everything except anti-Trump. There you go. Thank you, Ricky. Bring it up a little bit. Love that. I think that can't even forget Stevie for a second. We got to have that with her. And uh, unapologetic, you know, she didn't apologize. She, she's not backing down. She also said this, Vino and Ricky. She said, you know what? After the House stripped me of all my committee assignments, I raised so much money. The money just poured in. They just love her. She raised over a quarter of a million dollars. She said this, Ricky, within one hour, two hours. It poured in. All the conservative, you know, that's a big talking drum out there. Conservative think tanks, um, foundations, money all over the tree. Big money tree out there. We ought to bring Barry Strong in on that when we talk about money. Marjorie Taylor Greene. Good old girl. Good old gal. Country girl. They just love her down there. Trump country. What are you going to do with her? What are we going to do with her? But I got to tell you one thing. We can laugh about her. We can ridicule her. We can make fun of her. We can certainly savage her all day, but I got to tell you, Ricky and Vino, there's a lot of people out there that like her. There's a lot of people out there, Vino, that like what she has to say. There's a lot of people out there that agree with her. I'm just telling you. I mean, don't look at me. I didn't make it. Thank you, Ricky. Don't look at me. I didn't create Marjorie Taylor Greene. Matter of fact, Vino, I didn't create America. I didn't create any of that. Don't blame me. I cannot tell you anything.